pass the cord through the two holes in your castanet. All the way from one side to the other. One side of the cord should be shorter than the other. So now you're going to place the castanet in the center of your hand. Use your thumb to secure in place. Leave the shorter cord resting on top of your finger. With the longer cord, you will do two loops around your finger that has the short cord in the middle. Now, get the end of the long cord, pass it under the two loops you just did, going towards the end of your finger or your nails, and pull the cord. So after you have done this, you can remove your finger from the loop. This is how it should look like. It's going to be loose, so you have to pull the cord to tighten. And this is the complete result and you have changed the cords of your castanet. One thing you're going to notice is that one side of the cord you won't be able to move even if you pull. The other cord, if you pull, you should be able to move the knot up and down as you pull the cord. So you should have the knot closer to you. So the knot is in the inside. Then you're going to pass your thumb through the cords, because this is the finger we use to play castanets. And then you're going to pull the cord forward and pass your thumb again. This part of the cord should sit in the skin as close as possible to where your nail begins. That's the right position. And the middle of the castanet should be in the middle of your thumb as well. But this is too loose. If I play the castanet like this when I'm dancing, there is a chance the castanet could fall. So what you need to do to tighten is to pull the cords up and move the knot as close as possible to your thumb. But what happened is that the knot moved from the center of my thumb to the side. This is not the ideal place to have the knot of it because the cord can go in between your castanets and you won't be able to play properly. So what we need to do now is to adjust. For you to do that, just pull the cord around until you get the knot back in the middle. If you need any further adjustments after that, just pull the cord up lightly until you find the best fit for you. And that's the best position for you to play a castanet. So once the castanet is in place, what I like to do is to use the rest of my fingers to push the castanet. What this is going to do is to loosen up very lightly the cord around my fingers and it doesn't hurt anywhere. So I can move it comfortably when I'm dancing. So now you're ready to play and dance with your castanets. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you have any doubts, please send me a message. Thanks for watching.